Hey, what's going on, everyone? Swift bringing you a brand new Dead Frontier 2 stream today. Give me one second here. Getting all caught up. And making sure... Give everyone just a minute here. And welcome to the stream, guys. Uh, thanks for stopping by. We are here at the brother shop and we're gonna turn in some uh, condensed milk which is 22,000 each that's right 22,000 but uh, we're gonna get a little bit of compensation back I've got my uh, XP gear at least uh, one thing on for some extra XP as you can see there and uh you know, it'll it'll make some difference. So we're gonna go and uh, get some more XP here. So this gives me about another what twenty one thousand X just for having that pistol. So we get some cracked eggshells, some cash, and some XP. For those that don't know, the um, you can talk to these uh, NPCs twice, basically. I'd actually start with the A quest first because you, when you help the C brother, it counts as uh, completing a mission for survivors. So um, you'll get some, and you're actually going to get some more, uh, you'll get some more of this cash back. So I spent 66000 on those milks. I got fourteen k from the first completion. And then you subtract... 12.5 off of that, that no, the additional, okay, so like another 12.5 off the original amount, which is what, 66k? So we ended up paying about 40, it'll, we'll end up paying about 40k for the three milks, which is still a lot, but if you end up doing these missions, you know, 10,000 here and I mean, you can, you can get a lot of the money back. So you're basically, you earn your way to getting some free XP. That's kind of how I see it. But, uh, all right. So that's that for now. And uh, I, I'm actually, I'm buying these uh, chocolate eggs because I realize I'm like, oh yeah, I don't have to use the sugar dragons because that was the lunar one. So I'm just, I just sold all those because they're like 4K each. And... Oh, we're halfway to an elite answer, which is always cool. Okay, guys, so welcome everybody. So, um, we're gonna head back to the outpost. Like I said, I was just getting started with that, getting that out of the way. We're gonna take on some uh, Lepus tendrils when they appear. Um, I like how that. Purple Zone, it's called Ritual of the Rabbit, as per the theme of the video and the event. Cool. Okay, so Masked Leaper, that's where we are going to go uh, next. Um, well, I should say, let me go to the outpost, because it's right here. We'll go here, and then we're going to take on the, the Masked Leaper. For a second, I thought I was exiting the outpost, and I was like, wait, where is my car? Never fear. It's over here. Alright, so... Low priority, I do need to get some fuel, because when you travel to the training grounds, it takes, <laughs> like, 20 gallons of fuel. Well, at least 10. <laughs> Which is a little silly because it says it has no uh, consumption. Alright. So, guys, we're selling some stuff here. Anyone wants any find book stuff, you already know. I have some of the only remaining gear. So, I mean, you know, I can come down a bit on these prices. If you want, you know, if you watch this back, leave a comment. In-game name, etc. So, um... We're selling some lunar cakes. Uh, my alt character had a truck, a uh, car full of them, so we're trying to get some of that cash, some of that cash money, and uh, that's what I'm selling right now. So 
we can hopefully after a little while here finally get the uh reckless raider boots because that's my next school all right oh there's that stuff welcome everybody so uh, i know it's been a little while but we are back after a little break got to do that every now and again but trust me you know, i really like to play the game and uh i kind of showcase this for all of you guys so that is always good i sold my beanie hat for 300k well 250k i think like 240 it had 48 percent find a book that was cool um and i'm waiting for these lenses to go up in price see if they do got some ammunition we are ready to go guys we're ready to take on some bosses and i better actually get over to taking on the mass sleeper before i forget because i do that all right and then like i said you want to do your map marker right into the middle of the purple zone so there's no question when you're in the middle of the zone you could go equidistant up down left right and you are Still good for a little, like, about two blocks. Two blocks. Okay. All right. We just got to remember to use our buffs, and we are ready to go. Taking on the masked weeper, not singer. Okay. Zombies dancing again. Zombies are dancing again. Oh, this is quite a bit of a run. Yeah, you know, I should probably... Um, save me a little bit of time. So just... Be a little bit faster. Oh, so the good thing about getting this uh, reckless... The reckless boots, well, it's gonna be an upgrade in a lot of ways uh over the uh oh <laughs> uh, the, the difference is hmm <clears throat> good news would be i get more jog and sprint speed and then the best news would be uh, double, like, another, well, 50% walk speed, which is immense. That's really, really good. I don't know if I actually need that much, but... But, um, that said, the drawback of having those boots is you don't have sprint duration. Like, it takes... It takes so, like, I, I thought about it, and I'm like, well... Yeah, my sprint duration is going to go down. Yeah, I, I, you know. But I'm going to be, when I am sprinting, I am going to be running faster. And my cooldown will be max, which isn't too much different than what it is right now. But I mean, it would be a little bit of a difference. I mean, I'll notice it, right? But it won't be, I mean, it will be mitigated a little bit. It won't be like a complete loss, I guess is what I'm saying. Once you get your cooldown, uh, you know, maxed, I mean, that can, I mean, that, you know, it does, it does make a little bit of a difference, even though it's only, what, 2% for me, because I'm at 73. I mean, that, that's how I would go about that. All right, so we are running to take on a masked leaper and then we are going to just keep an eye out for the lepus uh pendril um zones because we just are coming back from running i didn't actually run the defense but there was an outpost defense so things got reset for a little bit there and uh, now it's everything is back up and going so we are going to take on a mass leaper which is pretty difficult as it is 
But I was thinking, I'm like, I mean, I guess you guys can judge from how I do in this skirmish here, but I I think the Mass Leaper, I, I, I think the Bunny Hawks are more difficult than the Mass Leaper. But your reward, you get more of a, you actually get a mission tailored to Mast Leaper versus the Hulk where you don't get it. I don't know, you know, I don't know. Alright, so we're in the middle of the zone. Just gotta find the Mast Leaper. There it is, there. Stay in the zone, stay in the zone, right? Amazing, like, how the shots seem to, like, uh, disappear through. Take any opportunity you can get to get those stun shots again. Oh no, whole new crowd of zombies, that's what I was afraid of. And come on. I gotta I gotta think of where the leaper even is. I don't see. It. Did it did it run away? Like what happened? Oh no, okay. Oh there's two of them. You can't make this up. There shouldn't be two of them because I'm one person. Suck. They shouldn't spawn two of me, you know. Unless I'm mistaken, but... Maybe I am mistaken. So... Bun there's bunny mask, bunny mask. Oh, but they have the okay. They have the same hopping properties. I think that's why I got. Them. Well, let's just see what it. Let's just. Uh... Yeah, like that stop reload kind of animation. Shot. Yeah. Just gotta keep doing that strategy. Keep doing that strategy. We got two minutes to go. So I gotta start getting DPS. On. Not worry about these other zombies. Any that are in my way, I gotta you know, knock down, but. Every shot's got to be focused on the, uh, leader. Basic. If I want to do this zone in. I'm hitting them with some good shots. Actually hitting them pretty good to Yeah. Starting to gamble a little bit because I don't have that much time. Else I can't really see through this. Did I hit him? I don't know. I gotta reload one more time. Got a minute left.
clean shot to the And he's got some help though. Oh, all these enemies have paint. Got him! I got him! With 50 seconds to go, let's go guys! Okay, alright, now we're gonna start dropping them. The annoying zombies. Alright, we dropped them right around here, right? Okay. So, get these zombies where I can see them! I will not be denied this loot. Welcome everybody. Oh. All right, let's get some of these zombies down. We got a new zone. Um, where did I drop? Where did I drop somewhere over here, right? But don't tell me I can't find him now. Oh, get out of town. He over here. Oh, this sucks. I can't find him now. Where did I? Where did I take him? That sucks. I got this bozo chasing me. Oh. That's BS. I Here we go, guys. I can't remember where I killed the Leaper at. It needs to be, like, markers. Like, when you... Where where did I... Put it over here? Yeah, okay, but... Your tentacles are a thousand feet. Yeah, it's believable. Believable. Alright, now where the blank is the stupid leaper? I know I killed him around here. You at Weeper. Seriously. Oh. It'll take me a year to find him. It'll take me a year and by the The, 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 my thinking is it's probably unique, of course, and of course I'm not going to find it. Oh, yeah. You get armor on and you're going to run that path. I believe. Uh, one last try, guys. Where, I mean, I know I took him out around here. Oh, I found him. Found him. Found him. Yes! Hey, it was an elite. I was so okay. I mean, yeah, all right. Nice. Hey, so Bunny Hulk, Bunny Hulk. Yeah, I guess uh, I don't think the tender one's as common, but. Uh, that's. These Hulks are just. It's a lot of ammo. There. Let's go back. I want to go back to the uh, outpost. Welcome, everybody. So good to see all of you. So we are playing some Dead Frontier 2 today. And uh, took a bit of a break, but we're back today. Just going to, uh, you know, try to take on these uh, 
purple zones, and really, um, you know, just a bit of grinding, just trying to get some more cash. Uh, actually, I got to turn in. We can go, um, now that I'm thinking about it. We can go to the brother shop. We can turn that mission. We we just took out the uh, master. So what we'll do, we'll go to we'll go to uh, Haver because I'm gonna fast travel there, and then uh, we can turn in that uh, mission for taking out the uh, leaper. Which is good because um, we'll get the you know we'll get the cash and all. I like these bounties. I will say, um, I like these bounties. I wish there. I wish there was more of them. Hmm. All right, guys. So we are back here at the outpost, and uh, took out. Like I said, we took out the uh, leaper. So that was good. Said to uh, repair the armor and stuff, heal up a little bit. All right. Um. So I'm about. 4.5 mil away from being able to get the uh, reckless raider boots. Uh. Quite expensive. So, um, I mean, if I sell, if I sell this lens, I'll be at about three mil. To... Let's go. I don't know. I'll still be, still be short of that, but I'll, I would be closer. And we're gonna sell the finest quality chocolate spread for eleven, a cool eleven thousand each. Now oh, they've gone down a little. This world's gone to crap. Raider, world's not. Oh wow, twelve thousand. And you know, I had I had two basically two carfuls of this stuff and it's still holding at twelve thousand. That is amazing. Wow. Alright, cool. Well welcome guys. So just selling some stuff here on the side. Again, like I said, I'm trying to save up for the reckless 
Raider boot. Alright, so we're gonna hit up these uh, purple zones here in just a second. Let me just get some eggs. And all that here. Probably could. If I don't need a lot of healing, I could just bring an anna. All right, we're ready to go. We got 306 of these eggshells, and I got to see... Oh. So 200 for the souls, okay. 200 for the souls. Do I want to make the mask? Because it doesn't have health. Yeah, I don't know about this shotgun. Yeah, the DPS is great. But I don't... My primary isn't a shoddy, it's a... Don't think so, guys. But, okay. So, uh, that's pretty cool. We've got, uh... All of our, um... Stuff we need. And then we're gonna go to... Turn in this, um... Mission here. Actually... Yeah, you know what I'll do? I'll, I'll bring the... Uh... Actually, you know what? Wait. You know what? I, I, I've i had a bit of a change of heart. I'm going to just equip all the XP. My thinking is because I don't get the 300%. So... Oh, you know what? Oh, I did... okay. Yeah, I have the gloves. Too. I mean, I'll be at what? 260 I don't have the professor hat here where I would. I don't know where the professor hat. I gotta find. Alright, so let's go to the outpost and uh, get some XP. <clears throat> we'll get some cash for uh, taking out that leaper. Uh, I've already got it marked, so you just gotta fast travel there. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for stopping by today for um dead frontier too okay we're gonna go to the brother shop and turn this mission in for taking out the masked leaper and what's cool about this i mean it's like a bounty right hmm i i think they need to have some for each of the uh npc or you know, the npcs should have like like this, oh, we're going to equip it. Fail, but you still get the cash and the. And you just talk to him again. You got to take out the east. I guess for demonstration. You bring your XP gear, then you equip it, then you would talk. Talk to that. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, so what's the point of bringing your gear if you don't equip it? I mean... Yeah, I, I just was going kind of fast. Alright. But yeah, that, that, that one mix-up cost me like 60, 60k XP. And it, it doesn't take one second to get that. Hmm. <clears throat> But anyways, guys, let me just catch up with the chat here. Demetrius. Hello. Yes, hello there. How's it going? And welcome to the stream today. We're just going through and taking out some bosses and some purple zones. Trying to get some more of these uh, eggshells. Kind of curious, do these have a... Uh, Scrap value. Well, they have a scrap value, but... Oh, I mean, a little bit of cash. A little bit of cash. I think, uh... I'm gonna see. Now... That's good to hear. You're doing well there. Alright. We are, like I said, just a few minutes away, like six minutes away from new zones. 
hopefully we'll get the tendrils on so I can show you guys the tendrils in case you haven't but you know what actually now that I'm thinking about it I'm gonna go to uh, Dalbo. I gotta take out the Easter zombies, so let's let's just start farming those. Any any uh, Easter one? Ooh, stalker! Gotta remember to take out. Do you know how much sprint is comfortable? That's a good question. Um, I'll show you. I'll show you my stat. So me, I have 54% uh, sprint speed right now. Um, 54% is is good, but I'm still not quite comfortable with that. Like, I mean, I feel like if I had maybe 60 plus, uh, I I think 50. I I was running with 50 for a while, and that was getting the job done. But um, even every few percent, I mean, it does make, I mean, it does make a difference. So um, I would recommend, if you can, um, try to get that number to be at least 50. I would say. At least 50. My goal is to get it to like 60 is I just need a little bit more speed for taking on some of these uh, purple zones. I'm more of a sprint guy. You know, I'm a more of a sprint player than uh, jog anyway. Still taking out the Easter ones. So any Easter zombie we get are right. Five cracked eggshells. So I don't think the rewards for this are as good, like for this event. They're still decent, though. So, I mean, if you didn't, if 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 somebody didn't uh, participate in the lunar one, there are still things you you know the players can get, albeit you know. Uh, I don't think the mask is quite as good as the the neon one, the the hair mask, or whatever. It's it's not bad. It's just not as good as the. I mean, the neon is overpowered. You know, that's that's over. I think that's I think that's the best one right now. All right. So let's see. Mm. We have four rare in here. All these, all these hats. Oh man, this is actually. Yeah, this is. A... I think I'm gonna the next enhancement. The enhancer is gonna be uh that rare that hat. That's what we'll do. I sold some stuff. Hitting E. Oh, it's not. Oh, it was glitched. I may as well get these missions even. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, and anytime there's an event, I feel like they should uh, update the outpost leader with some, like, bonus mission. Alright, guys, cool. So, uh, we didn't get many uh, eggshells, but we got some. You know, if you're really going for some of these uh, craftable things... I, I don't know, you know. I think... Um, you're just making another character. I mean, that's where a lot of this stuff is really good. I mean, you don't have like a good secondary. I mean, you can craft one of these weapons early game and do pretty. 
I mean, these gloves are nice. They're not. They're not bad. They don't have headshots. Uh, none of this. Actually, none of this stuff has headshots. Except for the except for the weapon that uh, where applicable, right? Where applicable? Yeah, like I said, if this mask had health instead of a unique item or something, I don't. Anyways. All right, friends. So let's see here. We've got one more minute until the zones are updated. Leperine disaster. <laughs> uh, yep, 20 seconds here. And we can check the progress for other missions here on... We gotta take out a twins a twins mutant. We gotta take out fingerheads. Sure I will at some A lot of a lot of uh take out bosses mission. I kinda feel like the uh, brothers one should have more like So we gotta help out survivors. So really by completing the boss boss one. And you could go to any low level, like you could just go to Dalbo boss room, take these. Out. That's actually not a bad idea. I should remember that I did that. Okay, yeah. Alright, cool. So, we should have the uh, new zones now. Oh, no, still no tendrils. Okay, well, we'll take on... I won't keep you guys waiting. We'll we'll get to the action. We're going to take on a bunny hawk. Okay? We will take on a bunny hawk as something. I was going to say, what's that, guys? Like, what are they swinging? So we'll go... I guess I could just run there. I guess. Sometimes it depends. I'll just run. Hey. Hey, Nedro, what's happening there? Welcome. We are running through to take on some uh, enemies in the purple zone. And along the way, I'm trying to complete some uh, missions. Bunny Hawk. <laughs> Look at him. He's like taller than the bus. Gotta get back into the zone. Gotta get back into the zone space here. Welcome everybody. All right, we are taking on some bunny hulks. We're gonna be taking on some tendrils when they spawn.
I can loot this. Whole world of zombies coming after me. Cool, well, we got we got that one out of the way. One bunny hawk down. And now I can go Oh, they're in the they're all the way down in the corner though. Alright, uh and we're kind of far away from the output. Just go. I guess we'll just. I really don't like to take on three Hulk. Let's just run. Uh, you haven't done the brother missions yet, bro? Um, well, so I did two of them so far. Um, I gotta do, so I'm, I'm finishing up. I need to still finish the, uh, Easter zombie one. And, uh, the, uh, helping the survivors. Because, um, if I, if I take on a couple more bosses, I think I need to take on two more bosses. That'll be, like, three missions right there. And then I just gotta complete the bunny one and then yeah then i should be able to complete that we don't have we don't have too much longer to go we're gonna go to this zone i mean i don't know that i like the right fighting three of the hulks but maybe there'll be someone here to kind of offset some i guess we'll see. no Oh, I hit E. Sure I'd, pretty sure I did. Alright, guys. Yeah, I hope everyone's doing well and, uh, you know, progressing in the game and getting some good stuff. So today's uh, overpriced items in the market are candy bars, chocolate bars, and... Uh, Condensed milk is 22k each. So if you find condensed milk, that's basically worth what a unique would be worth. A lower end unique. Find some condensed milk, guys. And you'll be rich in no time. Like me. And I'm still 4.5 million away from getting the boots that I want. So, uh, there's all there's always something more to do with this. That's what I've been finding out. All right, we got bunny hawks. and they are angry with me. I'm just here for the zombies. Here for the zombies. Here for the zombies. I don't think I'm gonna even fight him. I don't know. I gotta pick up these up. These guys are tanks, by We got five more Easter ones to go. Scramble drill, scramble drill. I have eight. Okay. I'm gonna say, why is it not registering? 
There should be two more. Okay. We need one more Easter. It's got to be an irradiated... That's what I like about these zones. This is actually a really good way to get your uh, progress towards your Easter uh, zombie mission because they're not always going to be irradiated, but that one will. Alright, so that's cool. Um, oops. And they're chasing me around forever. Look at these guys. They're relentless guys. They're relentless. So, whoa. And they're everywhere. These, these folks are everywhere. Now, if only it were the tendril. If only it were the tendril. I can still hear them. But I am way, I am super out of the zone. Like, I'm crazy out of the zone. Look at that. I'm not trying to even pull them. I'm just trying to get out of there. I'm trying to take in these Easter ones. That's the only reason why I was kind of doing that. Okay, I think they're going to leave me alone now. Welcome, everybody. All right, so... Uh... Yeah, we're kind of in the middle of nowhere here, but, um... Take on some Easter ones. I need to see what progress I Where are we at? Oh, okay, good. So I'm, I'm finished with the... Hey, we got Reckless Raider Glow. Reckless Raider Glow. Oh, actually... So... We'll go to the outpost. Let me, uh... Can't catch me. Faster than you zombies. Can't catch me. Can't handle the truth. Ooh, reckless raider boots. No, that's what I wanted. Reckless raider boots. Save me 26 mil cash money. It wouldn't even matter so much the, uh... Wouldn't even matter so much the uh, stats per se. It's all relative. I definitely wouldn't mind the extra sprint speed. Yeah, take out these uh, event zombies any chance you get, because you get a lot of XP for this. Alright, so we're just stopping back here at the uh, outpost real quick because uh, I want to get my XP stuff and this time actually equip it before. I'm just going to equip it. I don't know. I like running there and back a little. Yeah, let me think about it. I guess it doesn't matter because it's right by the outpost. So we'll just in lieu of, you know not wanting to uh, miss out on the XP we are equip this stuff Look. Uh, let me see here we're gonna have to get more coffee at some point yeah I don't know why I wasn't equipping the glow I know why I wasn't equipping the other weapon because I didn't want to lose the health. I mean if I have to spend 1k to get all that XP, you know what I'm saying? I mean, it's it's kind of like what? 
So just go ahead. You just equip the stuff. Now. There's no reason, you know, equip it now. And uh, we just got to find the shop, which I think I, I've marked it right. I marked the outpost, but it's pretty close here. So yeah, I'm going to run a little slower, whatever. So just find the brother shop and uh, have your XP gear in case you don't have the 300% uh, uh, XP already. Go here to the brother shop. And then uh, we're going to go to the C brother. And get some XP cash and some cracked eggs. It'd be nice if they had a third mission. I kind of feel like it would be like take on 20 bunny hulk. Something ridiculous, but have it. Right? And then you get like a crazy amount of Because these zones, in my opinion, they don't really give I don't know, they don't really give a whole lot for cash for I kind of feel that's lacking a lot. Now this one's decent. Tentacle Twins, actually. That's actually decent. I mean, I'm not saying it's great for cash. I'm saying it's decent. Like, I mean, it's it's passable. You can. Alright, so we got the XP gear. We ended up getting an enhancer. Alright, we'll just add it to the list. I think that's it for now. We got a... How many more survivors do we need? I think I'm two out of five, right? We need to help three more. So basically, when, when you're trying to do that, we got kill bosses. So really, all you got to do... It'd be interesting if there was a boss room in this place. It'd be so... You just go next door to this tavern. And there's going to be, a, presumably, a boss... And then you just take out the ball. Really don't want to waste my ammo on these zombies. I mean, we may as well just stuff real quick. Oh, I mean, you never know what you're going to pick up. That's actually kind of... Yeah, always, always pick up from bosses. Always pick up gloves because if you get the right combination of skills, I mean, they sell for all. All right, so we completed the uh, last of the... We did. Oh, we got to You know what we got to do? We got to... Technically, you can't do this quite yet. You got to go... Ah. Well, we still have three minutes anyways. So what you do, you gotta go to the notice board and actually turn in. Because it's not going to recognize that you took out the last boss until you do that. So, let's go ahead and do that now. I'll just demonstrate this for you guys. Welcome everybody. So thanks for stopping by. It's a new day and another day for some Dead Frontier 2. As per usual. Okay, so go to the notice board here. And hand in the missions. And obviously you could, you know, because I got, I think I got my gear equipped right. No, I, I don't. But yeah, what you do is you just have your XP stuff. You can get a lot of XP for just doing missions, guys. Like I'm saying, you know, definitely add this to your uh, do list. It's something that is of interest. To you. I mean, you can get twenty-two and a half thousand basically for a human remain mission. Well, I don't know. You know, stuff you can do if you want to level up. You can carry around a bulky axe, like. Um, I've already max leveled, but. I'm just demoing this, but we're going to go back to the brother shop because I want to finish the last of the missions. And we're going to go to purple zones. That's what we're going to do. And we're on the hunt 
for we're looking for the lepus tendrils because i actually like to fight them more than the bunny hulk because the bunny hulks are too tanky i don't mind fighting i don't mind fighting the one hulk by itself it's not really that tanky and it gives 10 eggshells but i don't think you get enough eggshells for fighting four hulks i think i really think they need to like triple that or something all right, so we've got all of our uh, boosts on here. Let me just show you um, the XP. Where am I at? Oh, 235. Okay, so 235% will get you 157,000. Roughly. From this bro. You get some more eggshells and some cash. So like I was saying, I paid... What was that? 66k... I paid 66k to get those condensed milk. After doing these four missions, I think I got like 40 something k back. So really, as long, if you're active and you do these missions, you get a lot of your money back. So just get them started and do it, right? Because you'll end up getting a lot of this. And you get a ton of XP. That'd be one thing I would say to consider if you want all right guys and then we're just going to equip everything again the only reason why i don't do that more is because it takes away my health but you know i thought about it and i'm like well i'll just put on the medic gear and then just heal up with the antiseptic spray i have which is cheap full health and then i can just go back to the outpost you can do it that way too all right so we got new zones uh Oh, we got mass leaper. Okay, we'll go take on. We'll go take on a leaper. Um, let me. Yeah, I want to take out the tendril. We'll, we'll we'll get them. It's just they're not really in the rotation all that much for some reason. I mean, but they're fun. I mean, it's a fun purple zone. What is this? Clan of the living dude. They're part of the clan of the living. That'll be the next movie that comes out. Because they're running out of ideas. Yeah. Clan of the living dead. Follow the clan around. As they traverse. Wherever. Talking about. Landscape. Alrighty. So let's put some of this stuff away. And I'm going to actually price these gloves because they're actually kind of good. Don't be fooled when it's like low stats and stuff. When you're looking, for, you're just looking for the skills. You're just looking for, you know, a headshot attack and XP. I mean, that's pretty good on random gloves. They can sell for a lot. I mean, we can check it out here in a moment. Let's actually do that. Um, I'm going to price these real quick, and then we're going to go take on that uh, leaper. Let me just mark the coordinates. And we'll go ahead and take what that. Can I do for you? We got uh, fingerless gloves. Let's just price check these super quick. So it's a rare breed. And we got what? It was 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 it headshot? I think it was headshot attack and XP, right? Where's attack? I think it's the XP, cause yeah, cause uh, this would be good for XP gear. Well, this is what I'm talking about, guys. Now I don't know if this is a real price, but you get the uh, you get the idea. That, uh, that's why I kind of, oh, it's because it has mutated. Yeah, that's why. That's why. Yeah, that's why. But, I mean, you can see this isn't very common. Um, and I just found it off of a random body, too. I don't know, guys. What? I mean, you can compare them to what I've got, too, for, for context. 
I mean... Okay, so... Do I save these in re Elite Enhance? I don't know. I kind of, I kind of want to sell them as is. Let's. I'm gonna try them for 100k. Oh, yeah. I, I, I'm cool with that because I kind of just found these, right? You never know what you're gonna find. Like I say, take out some bosses every day. I mean, you never know what you're gonna find. A lot of it's junk, but some of it's not. Trust me. I found some stuff I was not expecting to find. I was like, wait, what? That's worth 700k? What? What can I do for you? Alright, so... Uh, yeah, we're gonna head out to take on the masked sleeper. To buy some stuff. And we'll be ready to go here. Okay, very good. Make sure I was uh, all full health and everything. Okay, let's uh, let's go. Thanks for tuning in today, guys, for um, hanging out today. Hopefully, this is a nice change of pace from stuff going on. You know, try trying to, anyways. Try try to make that difference. All right, we got a bit of a trek here, but I think it's better to just fast travel to... Oh, I know them. Greywood. Oh, no, 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 no! Did he get a hit on me while I was mid-animation? You can't make this crap. Hey, no, it didn't count! Yes! Stalker, you did not hit me, haha. -ha. Oh, wow. Hey. Oh, guys, you know what? Hey, if you see a stalker, you can also fast travel with your car and you'll escape it. That's cool. I, I kind of figured it would do that. but You know, not only did we save some running time because now it's, what, 400 meters instead of, what, 1,100, which is a quite a big difference. We also evaded a stalker, and I don't have my my music on, so I didn't even know one was chasing me. I mean, I saw it at the very last second. I thought it was chasing the other dude, because I, I literally just got out of the outpost. So I'm like, why would a stalker already be chasing me? I just got out of the outpost. That, that, that didn't make sense to me. I was like, wait, what? Huh? I just left. How could the stalker be locked onto me when I just exited the door? But, hey, we'll take the free XP. I'm not adverse to that. Alright, let's go. Let's go take out a masked leaper. We'll help this person out. There's the leaper, there's... I, I don't have a good Stop jumping. I feel like they do that to kind of troll a little bit. There's no... It shouldn't be jumping at all. It's down. Alright, we gotta remember it's down in front of this house. Whoa. You tried to get me with the overhead smash? You tried to get me with the overhead smash? I will not be denied this loot, though. I just have to take out a wave of zombies. Don't lure them to me. Don't lure them to me. 
It's like they're doing it on purpose. I want to loot. No. I will not be denied this loot. Versus. Hurry, 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 hurry. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh. Bull baloney, I say. Hey, is there another hare following me? Hey. You better watch yourself. You're, you're basically the new stalker. We got a stalker and then we got a leaper. But they're the... <laughs> It'll, it'll follow me to the end of the earth. It's out of the zone. It'll follow me forever. Why? And welcome, everybody. <laughs> hey, yo, what's up there, Kane? That sounds good to me. Yep, uh, we're in the MMONA server. Does shooting the stalker give you XP? Um, so sadly, no. Um, it doesn't take any damn. Well, it has infinite health, so um, it doesn't do anything for XP when you shoot it. Um, but you can uh, evade it, obviously, or just wait five minutes to uh, get that XP. Uh, you can fast travel using the car to get rid of it if you're out here kind of thing or you could just go in here into the oh i actually did that like two minutes ago all right we are here and i got hit by that random zombie kind of annoying see like it it caught me when i was almost done searching All right, so we got a Kevlar vest. I I feel like the Hi. Oh, yeah. I feel like the chance to get a unique should be slightly increased for like the bunny hulks and because they're very tanky. Like they're very tanky. I kind of feel you know what I'm saying. Like I feel like that would be. Hey, these th these enemies take like triple the shots. Or, you know, triple the they have triple the health. Uh, let's see. I was looting in a building. A stalker entered the room behind the bed. I couldn't move. Oh, uh -huh. yeah, that kind of sucks when you get stuck on stuff like this, like stuff in a corner, a bed or whatever. And it's just like, I can't move. I can't. I can't. And then the stalker just pummels you to death. Like, no, you see it in slow, like in slow motion. You're just like that, that, that. That right hook is coming for you. You're gonna get punched. You you can't avoid it, and you just get clocked. You're just like, oh my gosh, I'm running into a bed that I can't move, and I get punched. Uh, so it's so silly, some of that stuff. You you should you should I don't know. There, there's so there's so much stuff in these. There's so, I get it, cause this is a lobby. This is fine. But some of those rooms are, like, packed with stuff, dude. It's, like, packed beyond... Really? Really? Do we... Do we need, like, five word... Word... I'm good with one. I don't even probably need one. <laughs> I don't know. You know what I mean? Alright, so... Welcome, everybody. We are... We got a fair amount of people here by the trailer. I wonder what's going on. What's the hubbub, bub? <coughs> we got the neon mask. We got, we got the hanged man's mask. We got the hair mask. We got baseball cap that's a neon mask. I have an override. We got all kinds of customization here. Guys. We got armor, all different colors. For the same Kevlar vest. You know... Hey, people are, hey, they're with the times, man. They are, they're, got it, they got it figured out. All right, so, um, Masked Leapers, that was pretty cool. We took that, we took that one out. 
like I said, in a couple minutes here, we're going to find out if we get to face a, a bunny, well, the Lepus Tendril. Because I want to show you guys. Do you recommend the carved hair mask from the event? I'm kind of new. Hey, what's up, Augusto? Um, you know what? I would say no to the hair mask, Augusto. Um, in my opinion... Like, okay. I'll show you real quick. When I say I don't particularly recommend it, here's the deal, real quick, right? I think, okay, so like, if you haven't participated in the last couple of events and you want to get uh, uh, headgear that's still good, I would craft I would craft it, but I wouldn't I wouldn't go out of my way to craft a bunch of them. I kind of feel like what you get is what you get cuz you can end up spending all kinds of cash. I don't know, is it like if it if it had health instead of a uh, unique item chance, I would emphatically say yes because dodge cooldown's great, but I don't know that there's enough compensation for me to make the switch over because I have health with mine. Uh, I hope that answers your question. I think the, 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 the best thing from this event, I would say, is these Leperine Souls. By far. These are these are the best in the game. These are the best in the game, right? I would craft these before the mask. Unless you need the mask, and then... I'd craft the mask, and then I'd craft these. Souls. I wouldn't even worry about these pouches unless you want to power level by taking on infected eye. I would go with these leprechaun. All right, very good question. I'm now level 33. I went on a frenzy last night. Just burned through a lot of ammo. Hey, you know what? Hey, I mean, get the levels, man. You know, get the levels. Uh, like I showed you guys, you know, I, I turned in some of those uh, missions, right? I mean, you know, during the events, I mean, that's really the best time to level up. You know, especially if you've got the, uh, you know, good XP boost, right? We're going to go take on a boss room, and then we'll see what the next uh, set of zones are. I've gotten I've gotten one rare enhancer so far and I haven't even been playing all that long. I'm about to get two because, you know, like I said, turning in those uh, brother missions gave me a lot of XP. Obviously not the max because I, you know, I missed out on a little bit of XP. You get you get the idea. Like I I still could have got, you know, a couple hundred thousand more XP from doing that. But uh, I didn't have all my stuff equipped. At the we're gonna go. Um, we're in the level 50 area, so let's just take on a boss or two here, real. I always check to see if there's N if NPC. Oh, and Optic Twins, that'll... Alright guys, we're gonna have to fight Optic Twins. Who is deadly as? Optic Twins or Swift? Is it possible to solo in named billings with tons of mutated? Oh, um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it is. Um, like, I mean, you know, depending on the building and the gear, like, if you go to the Pale Haven City Archives, I mean, I sell this one all the time. When I say that, that's just because I got a lot of endgame stuff. PCA for short, you know, that's the 
easiest one to solo if you um and then comers uh, i'm still not at that point i you know i do better there but i can't solo it um and then uh and then let's see oh and then you have ravenwall which i don't know i mean there might be one person in the game that solos that majority of the time it's gonna be uh, a group of people going to uh, Ravenwall. We have an optic twin. I'm just dork tone a little bit because I, I just want to make sure I've got clean, uh, clean shot. All right. We're just gonna reset the room. Reset the room, hold the door to minimize zombies coming in. Alright, you turn around. Super fast, super fast, super fast. And it can shoot me through walls. Me through walls. Walls. Oh, missed my shot. No. Oh, I actually hit the eyeball. No. Oh, I hit it again. I hit it again. I hit it again. Oh, no, 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 no. I got caught on a box, dude. That's so erroneous. Oh, I got caught on a pallet. I got caught on a pallet. Caught on a pallet! Oh, when it shoots at you, its eye drops down. Too many zombies are getting in the room now. Wait, did I drop it? I dropped it. I dropped it. Yes, we won. We won the battle against the optics. I got a PvP helm. Hmm. Okay. That's cool. All right, let's uh, find the other uh, loot here. Nothing very special. Twin sisters are faster than me. Yeah, the twi twins are crazy. We got more bunny hawks. We got more bunny hawks. We got some irradiated titan. Find it. Hmm. Uh, well, in. I guess for fun, we can go take. Yeah, all right. We'll go to the outpost and then we'll take on some. Yeah, I really want to show you guys the uh, the tendrils, but it's not they're not it's not coming up. Womp 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 womp. Oh, you tried. I was far away from it. You tried, zombie. Okay. Hey, I must have uh, completed a mission. Or actually, two. Nice. 
There we go. Okay, I'll take that. Do you think they need to increase the level to 100 and expand the map? Oh, I mean, yeah, I definitely think they need to uh, increase the uh, the level. Sure, uh, I would say. I mean, I think I think they could go to 70. And I think make a couple more buildings like uh, Comers and stuff. I don't like the uh, the movement speed, like lowering the movement speed uh, stuff that Ravenwall does. But uh, yeah, I would say as far as the map goes, I would say really okay. So taking it to two two part answer. For the training grounds or killing grounds, whatever it's called, the PvP, they need to update that because that's really kind of bare bones in my opinion. But as far as uh, the map at large, I mean, they have all this perimeter space, but there's nothing really out here. I think even just adding, I mean, yeah, it's countryside, I guess, but it's also at the same time, it's like, I, I kind of feel like they've got these, like, what is it, carnival stuff out here. Really, you should be able to go into those tents. I mean, there may not be much there, but, I mean, I don't know. There's certain things that I think that they could, you know, maybe maybe they can't because of bandwidth, and, and maybe, I don't know. So I always give the benefit of the doubt on that, right? But my hope would be because we're kind of capped right now. Like, we're kind of stuck. You know, yeah, the events are great, usually. You know, I, I think this one's decent. But I need I need a little bit more out of the game. Like, I need a little bit more. Like, um, you know, the, the good purple zones seem to be taken out of the rotation during events. And I, I, think, I think that's a mistake, actually. If it were, you know, if it were up to me, I'm not saying I know more or anything. I would just... My one hope would be, I just like to see that rumbling in the fog, because that's like a big showdown, you know? And I don't think it takes thunder away from the event, because I kind of think it brings more attention to the fact that there are a lot of cool purple zones in this game. I just think, you know, if you're drawing a lot more of your player base into the game, but they don't know about rumbling the fog, are they, are they going to participate, you know, when the event's over? Maybe they don't even know about it, you know? I don't know. Like the first game with P90 minigun explode. Yeah, I mean, um, yeah, Kane, to your point. Yeah, I mean, um, yeah, I definitely. I definitely could see that, though. Maybe they're working on some stuff. I know, I know, I mean, they recently uh, updated the servers. I know they're going to be putting more into this game. Oh, I shouldn't have uh, voted there. 
up one. Hey, we did it! Yay! Tried to group them all together too. you think you're going all right let's uh let's find these hulks they're not hulks uh, titan all right we got one we got we got to find three more here oh don't oh, oh i'm so sure like relax zombie it'll be okay all right where is the fourth one i that's it's all around here I... oh, here, we go. here we go found it hey that wasn't too bad, I guess. We'll put all the loot over here. Medic stuff, go. Hey, what's up there, Lucky? Welcome, everybody. All right. Taking on some purple zones, guys. Pick out some uh, titans. I wanna, I really wanna get to the uh, tendrils, but uh, they're not, not spawning. Them. I guess. Uh, Really striking out here. Uh, I guess we're we're right by we're right by these uh, boss. We'll go. I'll just take out a. Uh, I'll just take out like two, couple bosses real quick. They got a couple bosses. How does that sound? And I gotta get my buffs going anyways. Perfect time. Perfect time. All right, so we got Jose's Cafe and Emily's. Oh, yep. What's up, everybody? And welcome as per the... Good to see everybody. I know I, I know I took a break for a little while, but we are back. Oh, there's a mother boss. Like, I want to frame for a while. I don't know, though. It just health and how I'm doing and yeah, kind of a bummer I used to be able to play this game for like hours and hours but uh I will for a little while longer though don't worry we're gonna take on a mother boss a tentacle mother boss if I could hit my shots okay Creaky Corpse has an address to e to mail them, but no email. 
Right, I know. Wow, that 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 boss wasn't running at me for a long time. I was able to do all kinds of uh or kill. Should be good now. Well, we were probably good anyways, but... I'm way far away from it. Sorry. That... That makes zero sense. When a tentacle... hits me from a mile away, it's like... Okay. Like, okay, you got me. Tentacles are like 10 feet long. I wouldn't think so. We got a rare maze. Yeah, I'm just gonna scrap this. So it'll pay for some ammo. Do you notice that I'm right here looting by you zombies? Alright, we'll take on one more boss. Okay, Emily's ball. That zombie needs a pedicure. <laughs> I, 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 yeah, I know. I was seeing like, wait, what? Hey, what is this? Is this a lepus tendril or what? Yay! I mean, yeah, technically, because it's got the bunny hat on, yeah. Hey, we found it. We found one. Oh, optic, optic, optic. They really were trolling me today, guys. Yeah, those ones, they're going to take a little... We did it. We took out a Lepus Bloody Tendril. Yay. Should have been a unique, would have been great for the theme of the video. Okay. Oh, for anyone that doesn't know, haha. <laughs> yeah, like if you get in these corners and an optic or any zombie charges into you, you get bashed into the corner here. You're gonna have to, uh, like, go go to lobby or whatever. Happened to me the one day. It happened to me on stream, too. I was like, what? That optic zombie needs glass? Yeah, they just kind of blindly charge at you. How do you feel about the shotgun? Well, for this event, well, you know, as far as the DPS goes, people are saying it's the best, or really, really, really good, right? I mean, yeah, for DPS, sure. If you're looking for pure DPS, I mean, it's definitely, you know, really, really, really strong. For me personally, you know, I see that it's got like five in the clip and, you know, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera, and I'm just kind of meh to me with capacity. I think the Fat Man shotgun kind of runs into the same problem, though. It's really strong, but, you, you know, you only get, what, five shells or whatever. I don't know. I It's kind of preference, but I, I kind of... Me... I'm not super impressed with it, but it is good for DPS, though. If you're going purely for DPS, then I would get it, yeah. If you're going for a balanced shoddy... I mean, no, because... Like, mine, the one I've got, the Chesterfield I've got, I've got health, 
health and reload and all this stuff with mine. I'm, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I sacrificed some power, some raw power. But it's more balanced. And I feel like, you know, if it's my secondary, it's not my primary. It doesn't have to be absolutely... It just needs to be really good. Like, not... It doesn't have to be top tier. But it just needs to be really good. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> In theory, Swift's gun is an elephant rifle. Probably 700 grand. <laughs> Yeah, this, this rifle packs a punch, I will say. That's like, when, when I'm shooting these hulks and they're just taking and taking shots, I'm like, wait a minute. I mean, this is not a, this is not a small amount of damage here. Like, and, and they don't really give you that much cash, so I'm like, eh, they're not really worth fighting, though. It's not safe here. Like, the one hulk by itself is cool. I, I don't think you need to have four hulks for 15 shell eggshell. I think that they need to really increase that. Like, they really need to increase the reward. Anywho. Uh, damage versus mutated on a mace. I don't know. I think some of this stuff you just crap, right? Okay, let's take a look at what we found. Yeah, I always scrap the trainers. I don't. I was gonna see what, the, what how these gloves. Do. Eh, they're crappy. Kind of what I suspected. Okay, well at least at least we got some. At least we got some. We'll say that. Okay. We'll just replenish our uh, ammo supply here for a second. Alright. Mm, I probably could get some more... Uh, well, actually, you know what? 10 gauge is probably super expensive. 10 gauge is probably... Yeah, it's pushing 5. That sucks. Yeah, I need to buy some of some. I'm trying to minimize how often I use my shotgun. And I just... I just use the 9 mil. Because this, right, this ammo is so much cheaper. 1100, you know what I'm saying? It's cheaper. I'm glad I... I'm really glad I got the onslaught. Because look at how cheap this... When, when stuff is event theme and going on, that is when it becomes inflated. But if it's, you know, like if you... I know I just took some from here, but when you see a deal, I think you just kind of go for it, guys. I don't need all this ammo right now, but this is going to tide me over for a couple days. Yeah, I would think so. A couple thousand shots. Yeah. Alright. So, um... An optic mother. Oh, that's a bum. Man, all these bunny holes. Uh... Like 4K, 4K7 for 80 bullet? <laughs> Yeah, um, so Kane, how much does your rifle go for on the trader? Well, I don't think you can actually find the, uh, 
I don't think you actually can find the... Yeah, you can't uh, buy it or anything. Onslaught. But, um... If I had to put a dollar amount on it... We'll give you we'll give you an equivalent here. I mean in some regard. <laughs> so if you for context, this isn't gonna be like just because I said so, whatever, blah blah blah. But you get a rough idea probably what the value could be if it were in the market because you see the damage yeah the clip size is 30 on stairway but with with what i i i get 20 okay 20 is plenty 20 20 is a lot but then you just you just multiply you know the the i mean you know what's your headshot damage by your you know the clip size if you were to hit every headshot yeah, the attacks per seconds double with this gun. But you almost deal double the damage with the onslaught, so it's kinda I mean it's comparable in my mind. I don't like I don't like click 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 clicking because that leads to carpal tunnel, right? So that's why I don't like attacks per second like super high. Because it's like click 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 click. That's how you get the most out of it, right? Twelve percent movement speed. Yeah, twelve percent. Yeah. So yeah, like I said, with movement speed, you know that'll give you walk speed, jog, and uh, sprint. But with the uh, onslaught, you just get you get jog speed. What I like about this though, I could take I could take skill points away from jogger, and I can put them into other things because I got jog speed from my weapon. So I could actually go down a point or two on Jogger, and I could put it into Medic or something, you know, where I could get more healing out of my uh, meds here. So as far as that goes, I mean, that seems to really help as well. Yeah, movement speed, yeah. So, I mean, you can do stuff like you can drink... You, you can... Drink these coffees, right? Which is temporarily going to give you five percent movement speed and stuff. You know the uh, the chocolate the chocolate eggs will give you ten percent, I think. The maximum is fifty percent movement. So, you know, take that as you will. I'm just healing really quick. And I may as well. Yeah, so that's pretty much in how I how I would look at it though. How do you take the skill points away? So um you gotta find uh there's an NPC in each of the outposts there, Kane. Um, if you make a mistake or kind of want to revisit, you know, which skills you're working on, you know, kind of overhaul that or whatever, you want to go to um, the trainer here, uh -huh. and you can go um, skill reset. You go skill reset. It's going to cost you like 100 credits or whatever, so it's expensive to do, but... You get a free skill reset with every account. You don't get it per character, you get it per account. So, use it use it wisely. My recommendation would be manage what you have until you get to level 50 or whatever and then do it. I wouldn't do it level 33. I would wait, see it through, and then if you still want to go for that, which maybe you probably would, if you wanted to reset that, then I would do it. Um, for me personally, 
I reset mine like three times and I'm pretty careful with that too. But I just learned, I, I kind of learned things over time where I'm like, you know, maybe I don't need to have all five in shotgun expert the way I've used shotgun over the years. Maybe I'm good with this. You know what I mean? It just depends what what's your style. And then obviously there's going to be, I would think, some critical skills that are going to be five no matter what right figure out what those are to you i mean i would say i mean reloading and headshots really important you know what i mean so like certain ones you're probably not going to compromise on but definitely there's some wiggle room with some of these other ones like survivor you know uh, you know armor if you don't really use armor i guess stuff like that Yeah, so free for the first reset, speed, and SMG headshot boss hunting. Yeah, so yeah, kind of get that build in mind, and then, uh, you know, like I said, you're you're kind of power leveling right now, so that's good. Um, just uh, you know, you can you can reset it once for free, but then after that, it's going to be like 1.1 mil cash to do it. So, save it, and then, you know, take a minute, because it can be an expensive, uh, you know, thing to do. Like, I, I've done this myself a couple times, so I've spent a lot of money to reset skill points. But if that saves you cash, then absolutely. Alright, uh, well, we're almost, okay, so I'll, I'll play until I get uh, another rare enhancer, guys. I would play, I would go from, I would play longer, I just, I don't. I'm getting over a health thing, scare, whatever. So, still not 100%. Like, if if there was a better purple zone, I'd be doing that now. But let's, uh, I need what? How, mu how much XP? Like 41,000? Let me see if there's any mission. Let's see. How, how close am I to some of these missions? Um, I mean, uh, I guess I'll just, all right, we'll go. Yeah, I don't think I could finish this one in eight minutes. These hulks are too tanky in my opinion, or else I would do that one. All right, so we'll go one more, one more block of uh we'll go one more block of bosses guys okay actually i need <laughs> i need to get more of those chocolate eggs. so we'll go i'll write a letter to creaky corpse see if we can get some new areas levels weapons hey you know i would uh yeah i would uh definitely back that statement up like i definitely appreciate what they've done with the game my hope would be uh, that they consider adding some more stuff. For sure. For sure. Okay. Ooh. Good prices here on these Easter eggs. That's one more thing too, guys. When the event's about ready to end, you should buy a bunch of these eggs up. Just put them in your car and just wait like a couple months and they'll be like 4k each instead of 1k. You'll make profit on every single one of them. And if you have a car that can hold uh, 60 slots, a couple hundred thousand cash profit. Tips and tricks. You gotta use that storage space for something. May as well be to make some cash. Hey, what's up? Hey, Rashiv. I'm saying your name correctly. Hello, welcome. Hi, bro. Where can I find Rare Enhancer? Well, actually, hey, that's a great question. And uh, you came to the right place. So welcome to the stream. Uh, I'm actually working on a Rare Enhancer right now. So uh, feel free to tune in for a little while. We'll show you exactly how to get a Rare Enhancer. 
what you need to do is when you're uh, level, um, once you reach level 50, you're able to prestige and uh, every 500,000 XP, you get a rare enhancer. So uh, that is uh, really good and you can, you know, use them to enhance equipment and this and that. Uh, me personally, I mean, I kind of, uh, you can also combine them into a elite answer. So, uh, you can go either route. I'm in the UK. Where are they based? Um, I think they're in the States somewhere. I, I can't remember. Thank you for the like, guys. Appreciate it. Appreciate the support. I did want to say, uh, I know some of you know this already, so thank you in advance, but uh, I'm almost partnered here on uh, YouTube, so... Oh, that would have been bad. Uh, you know, really, 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 really super close. So, uh, oh, I can't believe I hit that shot. Huh? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Appreciate it, guys, and, uh, you know, just, uh, you know, it's like, I'm thinking, like, another two weeks I'll be partnered, um, at this, at this rate. I know I need to be a bit more consistent with posting. Yeah, I'm gonna try, uh, for sure, um, that zombie was spinning around, you guys see it? Alright, that was the last work count. So, um, yeah, once I'm partnered, I'll be able to do a bit more with the stream, etc. It'll help me cover some expenses on some things. Uh, I really wanted to show you guys a, a video game, a game that I have been working on. Well, it's been, it's been over a year since I have made any update to it, but I want to be able to play it again and show you guys. I mean, I spent like a month working on it. It's an RPG, but uh, it's actually, for what it is, for an alpha, I mean, it's actually, in my opinion, for one person working on it, really not bad. It's really not bad. <laughs> I don't know if I can get it to Steam or whatever, but I mean, it's a serious thing. Like, I'm really serious about it, but I can only take it so far, and the, any, you know, like, donation or anything, like, I'm just saying, like, what you can do get when you become a partner um some of those proceeds would be towards uh, getting the license to where i could work on that again and then uh, i'd be able to live stream that game once a week or something for you guys if you wanted to right so like uh, obviously dead frontier would be majority of the time as you guys know you you, you know that's been a, a you know I, i've been on track with that for a couple months now that's not going to change um, but I'm, I kind of like, uh, you know, once a week, you know, I kind of feel like changing it up every once in a while, but it would be a game like, I mean, I've actually personally created, so, uh, might be fun, you know, maybe, I mean, it's not a zombie game, right, but, uh, might be something different for another, you know, 30 minutes to watch, something, change of pace, right, but, uh, you know, all in all, though, just stuff like that, that would be on the horizon, obviously, more, there's more I could do with the stream for Dead Frontier and stuff, so, you know, it would really help me out immensely in life, too. Like, it would really help me out. So, uh, we just gotta, you know, just uh, continue. Um, it's basically down to the watch hours at this particular point. You know, I think the views are there, right? It's just the, it's just the watch hour. Or, uh, I mean the subs, right? Um, obviously, uh, feel free to sub if you're new to the channel and want to. Uh, that'd be great. Because, uh, I mean, I'm on here pretty pretty regularly. Uh, I haven't done as much with the videos lately as with the streams, but I definitely, you know, it's in mind, right? Um, oh, I thought that was worth more. Uh, rare leather gloves. But, uh, yeah, that would really, yeah, that'd be really cool. And uh, that's a personal goal of mine, so. We're, I'm playing through till this last purple zone, so we're going to do another rotation. Let me just see what these end up being. 
Uh, I do want... I mean, I have taken out a Lepus Tendril, This so technically the theme of the video is correct. But I thought the rotation was a little bit more frequent for the... I guess not. But we'll give it 30 seconds, guys. So, uh, yeah, thanks for the support. Um, you know, yeah, yeah it, it all helps the algorithm, and I'm sure you've heard that a thousand times. But for this game specifically, I mean, there really isn't, really aren't that many games like this game that are just as decent as it is for a free to play, right? So, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm just, I'm one player, but you know, it really does help the game because there are people, there are other other users that search for this event events like every you know every event but they're new players they're just getting into play the first time but this could be a game that they pick up and they're like oh hey this is actually a really good game you know maybe then they're going to have the bandwidth in order to expand the map and then they can do more with the the pvp and you know what i mean like certain things like that uh we got the uh the bunny hulks uh, we got a bloody fingerhead, and we got the one bunny hawk. All right, so you know what we'll do? We'll we'll take on a bunny hawk to kind of wrap up. But we'll, I'll go fight a bunny hawk. That's right. Uh, it's better than DF one on the grounds. It's not nerfed or changed every month. Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, I mean, I I felt like they've done a pretty solid job with this guys i mean i know i mean there's still work to be done there's still things but i mean they have done a good job with it. in my opinion they've they've upgraded the servers and you know they're still i mean if they're the fact that they're upgrading the servers after all this time i mean i'm i'm thinking like they've got plans for the game they're still working on a lab or something i know so, some might be kind of newer to play in this game, but in one of the patch notes, you can go back and see it. I think it was in January or something sometime. December, maybe. Uh, oh, no. The crows are going to follow me to the end of the earth. I didn't actually mean to trip this. I'm just going to enter a building and exit. The crows are going to follow me forever, guys. They, they always do. They'll literally follow me to the end of the earth. So we're just gonna get into a building. I'm, um, yeah, they're working on some kind of lab thing or something, and um, oh, free loot, and sure, I'll take an antiseptic. Um, I think that'll mean well. I mean, that would mean it. It could hint to some kind of expansion of some type. I don't know. Um, you know, I don't want to speculate. I think they still need time to do it. And I know from my my run-in with kind of creating a game, the little bit that I know, yeah, I totally can see why it's taken a little while. Because there's a lot that goes into it. it on the surface, it may not seem like a lot, but it's like... You gotta make sure it's gonna, you know, the server's gonna handle the... the, the the trap, you know, all all this stuff, right? It's like, eh, there's a little more to it than I would have first realized. Yeah, hopefully it'll be worth the wait, though. Let's try. Take on this uh, bunny hawk. One more bunny hawk for today. Let's make it count.
takes forever to kill. Which is incredible because my, my rifle has good stats. That's how you kind of know it's overpowered. If, it, if it's tanking event rifle shots, probably a little too All right, we gotta take out, what, two more of these, uh, zombies here? There we go. Hey, we got a rare enhancer, so, uh, who had asked that? Oh, Rasheed. Hey, so that's how you get a rare enhancer. You just gotta get 500,000 XP only. But no, once you get the 500,000 XP, then, uh, you can get one of them. You also get... Like a, a, you get like a color dye with it too. So you get, uh, you know, in my case, I got uh, black dye, but there could be really a lot of different colors, you know, brown, red, etc. And you can kind of customize your gear. Anything that you can, uh, you know, like you know, boots and stuff. Well, it'll, it'll let you do. Hmm. Hey, uh, thanks for the question. Um, yeah, I, uh, I was trying to get enough XP where you could see it, but then, yeah, you can see it's here in the inventory, uh, rare enhanced. And then, yeah, it'll show it up here by your level, uh, XP, XP that you have, uh, towards that, uh, milestone. Yeah. Just, uh, you know, wrapping up here. But yeah, um, feel free to subscribe. Uh, anyone, if you're new uh, and want to, or, I mean, if you've seen the stream before and uh, maybe meant to but didn't yet, so uh, that'd be great. Uh, yeah, feel free to. And uh, like I said, just wrapping up here. So uh, in the coming days, what I'm hoping to do is be able to stream a bit longer and, um, you know not get attacked by a thousand crows so <laughs> um you know i'm trying i'm working towards getting these uh reckless raider boots so we're gonna need a bit of cash to do that i'm about four and a half million away from getting them i'm kind of hoping they drop in price but i don't know i don't know if they will. uh so in the meantime just kind of grinding a bit uh you know running some purple zones Got a million crows after me uh, out of the zone, which I think they should kind of go away, but they don't. Hmm. Yeah, thank you for the info. Hey, no problem. Yeah, like I said, thanks for the question there, Rasheed. Um, and then Kane, obviously, yep. Uh, subscribed, liked, thank you very much. Appreciate that. Like I said, guys, um, real quick while I have everybody here. Um, you know, I was on uh, Twitch for a little while, you know, and uh, all I would say is, I mean, that was a good experience, but uh, it kind of led me to start streaming here on uh, YouTube. So, uh, that said, uh, I mean, I'll try to, I'm going to try to do a bit more with the stream, like I said, you know, it's kind of like one thing at a time, like, just got to get, got to see what works, what doesn't, you know, stuff like that. But uh, we will be back uh, tomorrow. Let me just deposit some stuff for now. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, it was good to see everyone today. I do want to try to stream uh, longer tomorrow. So be on the watch for that. Uh, like I said, this event's going to be going on for a couple, couple more weeks. So it's kind of like pacing yourself. But it's also, you know... Just try to get that XP and uh, those eggshells so that uh, you can get some of this event stuff, you know, to craft if you want. You know, I would recommend going for these souls, in my opinion. I think this is the best item here. Anyways, guys, um, let me just catch up on the chat here. We need explosives and flamethrower. Yeah, I mean, I'd be down for, I, you know... It, should definitely have a bit of change of pace with some of that. Uh, too much competition on Twitch. 
YouTube is easier. Yeah, oh, I know. Yeah, I know. The only thing, the only thing with Twitch is that its uh, interface is a lot friendlier with the, you know, the chat, like, like interacting, you know, with you guys. I could do more with certain things on Twitch than I can here. It's just a API thing, my understanding. But nonetheless, I mean, I think the community, I, I like, generally speaking, I do like YouTube. So anyways, guys, uh, that's going to wrap it up for today. Hope um, what I had mentioned during the stream was uh, useful and helped you out. Uh, that's why I do this, right? I mean, obviously, I want to play for a little while, too, and just kind of showcase the game. But you know, at the end of the day, just trying to help out and uh, give you guys uh, some information that might help you uh, to get more out of the game and to progress uh, towards your goals. So uh, I think I'm going to leave it there today. I was just checking if there was anything good in the market. So uh, let me just catch up on chat one last time. Once I hit level 50 and buffed it, I'll do a dual run with you. Hey, that's cool. Yeah, like I said, guys, um, well, normally, normally I do create my own lobbies. Lately, it's just been uh, getting into the... Um, MMO servers and just seeing who's on kind of globally. And then, you know, I kind of luck out. Sometimes I'll see a couple of you in the same lobby and then we can kind of just run from there. But, you know, I, you know, you can definitely uh, create the lobbies too and kind of uh, squad up that way. But, uh, all right, guys. Um, and welcome to everyone that's just joining. Thank you. Um, I'm actually wrapping up today's stream. Uh, you know, I'm going to try to definitely in the coming days uh, be on more. Uh, but uh, thanks for watching. Support's really helping me out. Uh, I'm close to my goal of becoming uh, partnered here. And uh, it's because of you guys. You know, like I said, I'm just a player. So uh, thank you. And uh, we'll catch you next time. Um, Rashiv is asking is love i'm level 37 is that good i mean 37 i mean is a solid level um you know you're you're at that point where i mean you're still gonna get levels and you're still gonna have some gains from doing these uh i don't know if you've if you've done these brother missions but if you go here to haverbrook you can go to the brother's shop and you can start those uh, missions. I'll mark that on the map for you in case. Um, that's that's a level where you can actually start to do some stuff. Like you could go to you know Greywood here and you can start. You're kind of in that range where you could start to take on the zombies and you know loot some stuff around here. And you're gonna get more out of things once you hit fifty, obviously. But just keep working from there. I mean, you're pretty. You're getting close, so. Uh, that'd be my uh, recommendation. Just keep getting those levels one at a time. Just keep working towards that goal. Yep, yep. And then, yeah, like like I'm saying, next time, guys, uh, I will definitely tell you guys the uh, the lobby stuff uh, tomorrow and whatnot. For anyone watching this after the fact, we're going to have probably a lobby going tomorrow. Uh, for anyone that wants to run through uh, some of these... Uh, you know, purple zones, etc., to kind of get uh, some of these down pats, get some of these eggshells if you want to craft some stuff. Just uh, let me know. I will, uh, anyone that wants to join, I mean, you can just join anytime, but you can, you know, just say a comment or something in the chat too, so I have an idea, because there is, there's a limit of eight players, so, uh, you know, if there's more than eight, we could make a couple rooms or something, but... All right, guys, uh, that'll do it for now today. Uh, but uh, don't forget about me because tomorrow or the next day we will be back for some more Dead Frontier 2. All right, guys, have a good one and peace.